we're also we're also very conscious that we are the only Jewish community in the, of any size in the Southeast Asia region without dismissing New Zealand as not the size of the Australian community. It's a real community. So we take our responsibilities with Indonesia, Thailand, Malaysia, Pakistan, Philippines, etc., very seriously. And the Australian government has facilitated leading groups of Muslims from Thailand, Indonesia, Philippines and other countries. When they come to Australia, we try to get them to come to the Sydney Jewish Museum or to the Great Synagogue in Sydney. If it's the Great Synagogue, they learn about Judaism. If it's the Holocaust, if it's the Sydney Jewish Museum, they learn a lot about the Holocaust as well. And so uh, we also do what we can to educate people from that part of the world. We have to remember, Indonesia, Pakistan, Bangladesh and India are four countries. In each of them individually have more Muslims in them than the Arab Middle East. Indonesia is the world's largest Muslim country. The question is whether India is second or Bangladesh is second. But uh, we're talking about large populations of people who really don't have any innate hostility, but they do have an innate lack of knowledge, and we try to do something about it. It's about anti-Semitism and about the Holocaust. And although at the moment we're dealing with leadership rather than the masses, uh, we hope there'll be a benefit you know, in the years to come from that sort of program.